I found Swapbox helpful because it gives me access to both teaching content in terms of the learning and teaching resources I can find, but it also gives me the potential to share ideas around developing pedagogy and learning designs with people from a similar disciplinary background to me and who share the same teaching challenges. I came to Swapbox with a specific challenge that I was preparing a session that was already constrained by time and a lecture theatre environment, but I wanted to develop something that was engaging for students, that would stimulate their thinking, um, encourage them to engage in more active learning, um, and take that beyond the lecture theatre environment. Swapbox gave me access to a range of learning resources that covered not only the content I wanted to include, but it also let me search the type of resource, as I was particularly keen to find um, a video that provided a service user voice, and I could specifically search for that, confident that any resources I found would be discipline specific and also licensed for use within the teaching context. The main resource I found was written by someone who's a recognised authority in this field and it gave me the confidence to take her advice on the types of areas that should be covered as well as to take some of her suggestions as to how these might be addressed with students. One of the potentials of Swapbox that really excites me is the fact that incorporated within its design are ways in which you can seek out and engage in collaboration with others. Being able to see the way other people might have approached a topic, for example by viewing their comments or resources they have themselves uploaded, uh, allows you to reflect further on the approach you were planning to take and on any changes you might make. You can put forward your ideas and potentially engage in discussion about teaching approaches that others have taken, all within Swapbox. So it's easy to share, record and return to those ideas to stimulate further developments. I'd like to think this can lead to collaborations within um, a dedicated community that can enable us all to respond to the changing curricular requirements that we all face. In my case, I found excellent materials and I could find more resources by searching by the name of the author. I also know that I could have put a request through Swapbox had I not found what I was looking for or a request for recommendations from the community. Once you've used Swapbox to find resources, you realise that there's so much more that can be done there. You can put back what you've made from the resources you've found and you can also contribute an example of the design you used that included the resources that you found in the first place. And hopefully, this will lead to further discussions within the growing Swapbox community. My overall conclusion, having used Swapbox, is that you get out of it what you put in. And the more people that engage with it as an active space in which to discuss the content and process of learning, the more we'll all benefit. <laughs>